Today, we're going to take a look at the Insert Zoom feature in PowerPoint. Wouldn't it be great to have an introduction slide or summary slide, and then you zoom in to the different parts of your presentation? That ensures that you don't lose sight of the topics, and it also allows you to quickly zoom into the various sections. Now, let me show you how you can set it up. First off, insert an image. The next thing you need to do whenever you use Zoom is to create all the slides you need for your presentation. So in this case, I just have these six slides that I'm presenting. Go to Insert under the Links category, select Slide Zoom. Here you get a pop-up that shows the different slides in your presentation. So in this case, I'm going to select all the slides which I want and click on Insert. What it inserts are actually links to those slides, and I can see the image of the slide. The image is actually live, so if you change anything on that slide, it's going to reflect in here. Now let's fit our slides in these frames so that it looks neat and clean. Do this for all the slides. Take your time. After that, I will tell you about an important Zoom feature, Return to Zoom, which we will be using in our presentation. The most important option that you're probably going to need when you use Zoom is Return to Zoom. So let's just activate this for these slides. Select the slide image, go to Zoom menu, and put a check mark for Return to Zoom. Repeat this for all the slide images. Now let's go back to presentation mode and see what happens. Go into the second one, Click the mouse again, it takes me back to slide zoom. So click, click, takes me back. So that's how Zoom works in PowerPoint for Office 365 and 2019. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to get updates when I post new videos here.